changed, do you think, since the RMA three, four years ago? Yeah, I think things have changed. As we progress, right, as, as a nation, as people, we learn things and then we adopt that. So, like, has the chicken, rice, and broccoli changed? Yeah, for the hardcore, maybe it hasn't so much, but I think generally speaking, yeah, a lot of people are thinking, wow, well, I should grab a greens. If you look at like Inspired Nutraceuticals, for example, they've got a greens, they got first form, they got a greens. So you're looking at like classic sports nutrition industry who've gone a little bit more active lifestyle. So if the hardcore is still there at that company, let's call it Inspired, first form, whatever, that's great. They can still have a killer pre-workout but they can also have a greens, they can have a reds, they can have an omega, they can have a, you know, a vegan protein, you know, so I think that consumer, yes, they can still do chicken, rice, and broccoli, absolutely, 100%, but I think we're evolving, that consumer's evolving, and the brands are evolving to match it, and we see that constantly, first form, ghost, inspired, there are numerous, that are going this direction. Optimum has been doing that for years. Yeah. The, whole, the entire gut health. Right. Versus just prebiotics. Right. That's where it's going, whether you're on the train or not. That's where it's going. What happens when everyone starts doing that? When people catch on and we start seeing everyone's doing a three in one, everyone's talking about post, right. everyone's doing everything for gut brain. The, they speak to each other, they communicate. We're doing the whole body now. Now we hit that that place what happens then yeah everyone said hey man the future is online and so people in the online business were like it's all online and so they're making money and they're an agency and they've got like a return on advertising spend of like 10 it's like hey look brand i'm gonna i'm gonna you know have you spend a dollar with me and i'm gonna make you ten dollars in revenue and then it was like eight and then it was like six and then it was five and then it was the cost per acquisition rose you know, consumer acquisition. So I was like, man, the biggest problem is like, the biggest benefit actually, is the fact that like people adopted the online consumer, right? The biggest problem is that people adopted the online consumer, right? So now, so it, it is like paradoxical, right? It's, it's like, man, it's now incredibly expensive. So let's say everyone jumps onto this bandwagon. What do we do? We're gonna have to move our cheese. Right, we're gonna have to like, we're gonna have to deviate. And I don't know what that's going to be, but the design of a company should be flexibility. But if we were speculating, it would be what you just said. It would be things that kind of bolted onto the axes of the gut. So let's say everyone went gut. Oh my gosh, what do we do? Because now everyone has resistant starches, everyone has polyphenols, everyone has short chain fatty acids, everyone has three in ones. Now what? Anyway, okay, we would go brain. All right, so now it's like core biome plus t cream. Super cool. And then like, okay, well, lutein. Wow, like really cool. So now I got core biome, lutein, okay, cool. Now it's like, oh, you know what I wanna do? I wanted to add a little bit more of the antibacterial portion, like SIBO, like from SIBO to leaky gut. So now it's like, okay, so if I don't have I have gut fuel and I've got brain fuel. So it's like kind of one and the same. So now I do like an antimicrobial. Then I have core biome and then I've got tea cream. So now we're like, now we're circling like everything that you could do in gut brain. And then someone goes, man, vagal tone. And there are certain probiotics that help with like the vagus nerve, vagal tone, things of this sort. And then you start like playing around with hormones and things like serotonin and dopamine. And you can see, this is a long-winded answer. You're almost like, God, is this guy gonna shut up? <laughs> I'm actually wondering the same thing. Am I gonna actually shut up already? <laughs> going. But this is that gut brain thing. You see how this, 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 how, how big this can get. Mm -hmm. And we didn't even go with gut immunity, gut heart, gut skin, gut muscle, gut allergy. So think of all those little circles that we just painted in that one gut brain, how many more circles are we gonna go around in all those other axes? We've got a bit.